In honor of Avatar 2 hitting digital, let's talk about how James Cameron almost made a Spider-Man movie. So, a script was being worked on for an upcoming Spider-Man film in the 80s and 90s with Leonardo DiCaprio as Spider-Man, Nikki Cox as MJ, which would have been way better than Kristen Stewart's mid-version, and the cast is stacked. We were gonna get Kevin Spacey as Green Goblin and Arnie as Dr. Octopus, the power of the sun in the palm of my hand, but the main villains of this movie is gonna be Sandman and Electro, and Electro is gonna be a Trump-esque businessman who has the power to control electricity. Michael Douglas, who plays Hank Pym in the MCU, was gonna play J. Joe and Jameson in this movie. The film was gonna be rated R and have Spider-Man throw some F-bombs and other curse words, and it would've had a very intimate scene with him and MJ in the Brooklyn Bridge, quote-unquote webbing her up. It had a can it due to rights usage, so it was up in the air, but other Spider-Man directors used ideas from this movie into their movies, like Raimi's organic webbing with Toby, that was all Cameron's idea. Just don't expect Leo to come as Spider-Man in Secret Wars, because now that superhero movies are so big, he doesn't want any part of it. An R-rated Spidey film has potential, but this one had too much going on, but the script is leaked onto the internet, so check it out if you can.